I, I really enjoy going to uh, Doctor Who events and you know, I've been doing it for a good number of years now and, and uh, it's always a nice surprise when they still want me to come back and do another one, so it's, it's good, yeah. I, I did not think that when, when, we were, when we were shooting the thing that 20 years later I would be celebrating it, but, but here I am, so it's great. I've got a decent amount, I still remember quite a bit about it actually, I've got, I've got a, uh, I've written about it in my book obviously, there's been a, there's a few, I've, I finally cemented, because you know, it's, it's easy to, there's actually, there's a, uh, there, is, um, there is some scientific evidence now that when we access our, our memories, we, we, it, they change, they, they biochemically change in our brains, they're actually manipulating them as we access them, so it's, pop, it's possible that you know, you you might tell a story over and over again, and then and then it morphs kind of thing over time, right? Um, so it's kind of nice to get all this stuff on paper and and, and have it be you know and have the original uh, some of the original um, uh, production documents to reference as well. So it was really helpful because you know memory wouldn't serve me, but I I had these things these documents to reference. You know, well, on this day we were at this location, and you know so it's kind of nice. So so yeah, so um, so there's a load of stories in there. Um, it's uh, I don't know if I. I mean, if I tried to do it all right now, it would take us three hours probably, but uh, I don't know. My, probably my most memorable story is the fact that we were, um, we were, shooting, at the, uh, we were shooting at this outdoor location with this, this water, this kind of like a water feature. It was like this sort of man-made pond, lake kind of thing with these cement slabs, and it was where the uh, fireworks scene at the end takes place, uh, the very last scene of the movie, basically. And we were setting up for a shot, um, and I think, I think we were actually rolling on the first take or, or maybe doing the blocking for the for the, for the for the scene and all of a sudden I felt this like this pull this you know this, this force acting on my body and wham I was in the drink oh. um, <laughs> so I, I guess I, at some point I just stepped backwards off one of those concrete slabs and was literally completely covered in water and and so some of the crew thought it was funny but but others had to do a lot of work to get me cleaned up for the for the shot so um, uh, and I hate cold water too, so it's one of those memories that just like, I'll never forget it. But, I mean, that, that doesn't mean that uh, my, my memories of the movie were like, you know, not fun or anything like that. It was a blast, obviously. Mm -hmm. Daphne, we've now gone to loads of conventions together now, and, and, uh, and, and we get on like peas in a pod, so that's, so that, and it's, she's lovely to work with. I mean, there's, you know, you, no one can say a bad thing about Daphne. She's just a really lovely lady. Um, and Paul, say, same, same with Paul. I've, I've never, you know, never uh, heard a bad thing about, about Paul, and we, we hang out. We didn't do a lot of, necessarily a lot of filming together. I probably spent more time with Eric Roberts, for example, right? Um, but, uh, but since the movie, um, going to conventions and such, whatever, we've, we've become, we've become friends, and, and, um, and he, He's obviously quite busy still, you know. So he's not at every event that I'm at, um, and um, uh, but s sweet guy. I know that sometimes people have concerns about you know being pigeonholed or 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 you know they they want to be remembered for something other than what they're remembered for. And I mean, I don't. I just. I honestly don't have that. I I don't. I don't feel that way about any of it like if it, it's really up to the fans isn't it? I mean it's not I mean who am I to tell people who to remember me for that's not that's you know what is that that's just uh, um, I think it's just more ego than I have maybe or something I don't I, I or I mean or maybe I have an ego but I just don't think about it in that way I don't know um, I, uh, I I just I'm very grateful that people remember anything really so <laughs> I know how hard it is to remember something I did 20 years ago so for them to remember something I did 20 years ago is, is just a, a treat really I don't make it out to the UK that often I was here for the 50th um, the big 50th celebration or whatever but it was such a big event that I think some of the fans here um, you know weren't able to find me or whatever, but I've had more than a few fans being, you know, saying like, I've waited a long time for you to come to the UK, and I've really wanted to, you know, get your your autograph on this, or have a chance to, to chat with you or whatever. And, and this was the time they they got their opportunity to do it here, and um, so I, I think that's really great. Like I, I I hope that I get to do it again sometime soon.